circle round me to ensnare All the demons picking my bones bare Watch the scent of you out of my hair Look into the flame and tell what's there Seven clothes flying to the waist There was carrying away my unrest I thought it was a curse but I know I've been blessed Free the power just a world. Hello, beautiful, beautiful friends. My name is Zoe Fromer. Uh, welcome to music. Oh my fucking God, this is my first time playing out and I don't even know how long. And it feels so good to be on stage with two people I really love to make music with. This is John Young on bass and the incomparable Koa Ho on the berry guitar. Uh, these are two gentlemen I really love dearly and that I've been making music with for a really long time. And um, all right, show of hands. Who here broke up in the pandemic? Who broke up in the pandemic? Yeah, that's right. So all these fucking songs are pandemic breakup songs. And um, I, am a, I am an angry witch, so they're also all spells. So that one was called Can't Run Away. And it was about, you know, just being fed up and being like, I'm fucking done with this shit. And you can't run away from that feeling of being a bad bitch. So a lot of these songs are about being a bad bitch. So, uh... I hope that resonates with you. Uh, this next song is also a spell, as I mentioned, it's called Honey. And it's, uh, it's about that feeling, it used to be called um, Honey, I've Been Done With You. And now I just shortened it to Honey. So when I first wrote it, it sounded like this. It sounded like a fucking Adele song. And then I brought it to John. So it was something like, uh, oh, what was it? The, uh, fuck, it was in D, right? Yeah. It was D, what was the? Da, da, da. It was like a. It was just like something really like a deli, like, like, like that. Fuck, what was it? It sounded cool, but it was basically an Adele song, and I'm not Adele. I'm the furthest thing from her. So I brought it to John, and he helped me bring it to its current state, which is, dare I say, a lot cooler. Maybe I'll remember what it sounded like, but obviously it wasn't that important if I didn't remember. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just 
plenty of things that now I just won't do I won't feel you at my fingertips In the midnight hour when the day is new You're not stirring next to me When the light, sunlight Bounces off the moon When the tears that I bleed Thinking, thinking all the things we didn't do I don't see you in my future So it's best that I don't sing to you the silent seething fuck you. It's way better to be like, fuck you, than like, fuck you, you know what I mean? So that's that's that one. Um, this next song is called Permission, and uh, I think we were actually recording Honey in the studio, and I was just like sitting there, you know, John's like mixing, whatever, and this song just like came to me in a flash, and uh, this one, this one's about, about being a bad bitch, like that moment when you make that decision, and you just kind of wake up and you're like, yeah, that's right, I'm the fucking shit. Um, so this one's called Permission. It's for all my bad bitches out there. I see a couple right over here. <laughs> Some, somebody 
surprised me, and I wasn't expecting it, and I uh, got, got a little thrown off there, but um, that's, that's permission. Um, I don't even know what song I'm playing next because I've been so pleasantly surprised. Oh, okay. Thank you for that cue, Koa. So this is a song um, I wrote a long time ago. A lot of these songs I wrote after I got sober, so um, Bad Condition also has like a little bit of a secret meaning because I can't drink alcohol, so I have a bad condition. What? Um, so this song, uh, Four Seconds, I wrote before I got sober and I was really fucking stoned. And I was watching uh, Anthony Bourdain. I don't know if it was Parts Unknown or uh, No Reservations. I think it was Parts Unknown and he's in West Virginia in this mining town. And uh, they say that there's like four seconds of silence before the explosion in the mine. And uh, I was really stoned and I was like, whoa, that's so cool. So uh, it's interesting how much darker these lyrics kind of are. Um, but this one I wrote with Koa. And every single time I would go to his house to record, I'd be so excited when we were done that I would make a really bad pun and he'd say, to get the fuck out of my house. So, um, yeah, that's 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 the relationship that uh, that we have. I'm gonna, you know what? I'm not a mic stand kind of girl. Yeah, I know. Uh huh. It's happening. You've seen it here first, folks. Hold on one sec. Also, I just want to look at your beautiful face.
Thank you. Yeah, that was a lot darker. All right. More more embarrassing jokes. So um, we're gonna we're gonna do a Mac DeMarco cover. Mm hmm. So I think the most Brooklyn thing that I ever did. I'll continue this on the other microphone. longer a Brooklyn gal, but I think the most Brooklyn thing I ever did was I was hooking up with someone, and then when we were done, it turns out that Mac DeMarco was playing the entire time. <laughs> yeah, that was, it, was, it, it wasn't good. I don't know. I wasn't thinking. My brain was turned off. It's the most bushwick thing. It is the most bushwick thing you can ever do. So um, I really think that this song um, encapsulates, you know, the, the feelings of... of Kind of being torn um, of the other songs that I've uh, that I've done so far, so I thought this would be a nice little addition. Hold on. Yeah. A little louder. Okay. Does it, does it matter? Is it just gonna keep going? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Don't matter. Don't matter. Jesus. It's all you. All right. Uh, 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 uh. surprised me and I completely forgot the first verse to that song but that's okay um, yeah you know sometimes sometimes life is really good uh, so yeah, can you John can you make that stop <laughs> yeah I was not, I was just talking um yeah uh, so this next song I'm gonna do one by myself and let's hope I don't fuck this one up as gloriously um, this song is called velvet and uh, my old guitar player Andrew when I wrote it, asked me if I was okay. So that should give you a feeling about that. Um, yeah, I wrote it when I was still in a relationship and it's a breakup song. So yeah, after 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 that ended, my guitar player was like, oh, I, I was wondering about that. Um, but I'm gonna slow things down just a little bit. Let me figure out which one is the sustain. There's our sustain pedal. I know how to play music. I know how to sing. I know how to do all these things. 
Yes, but apparently not today. so much for coming out tonight uh we've got one more for you uh one more ballad we're going to end it with a ballad this one's called i want to go home i wrote this oops. i wrote this one uh when i was bartending one night and it was like it's like 3 45 in the morning and everyone's ugly because they've all been drinking too much and you just want to go the fuck home you just want all these idiots to leave so you can go home and be sad by yourself. So, uh, you know, I'm just like wiping down the bar and bartending with my buddy Jack and, you know, I'm just like, I want to go home. Wait a second. I want to go home. And then I took that home and the rest was history. Thank you so much for coming out tonight. And uh, here's the last one for you.
My name's Zoe, this is John, this is Koa. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful night. One sec, one sec, one sec. This is, this is jazz, guys. All right, so this is another song I wrote about being in a bar. So it's, it's... It's country. It starts on, on, on E. So it's one, four, four, five, four, one. That's it. Yeah. You get that pace? Yeah. All right. Okay. This is what this is called Lower East Side. Um, this is a song about winding up drunk in a bar for weeks on end. I need you all the help though. And the sun hasn't yet started its creep across the building to start a brand new day. It's a little hard, and I ain't getting much sleep, but I wouldn't have it any other way. Don't you know my brain's too high, and the internet's down, and the only way I'll make it in this here town is if I keep my head down and I just do my time. But believe you me, I made it, Mom, I made it, Dad, doing the best that I ever done. Had. 